Sulfur number 11, xenon difluoride, 8 electrons from xenon and 7 plus 7, 14 electrons from fluorine. So, 22 electrons are there. So, these to be distributed so that each atom gets an octet. So, xenon at the center, fluorine on either side. And here, xenon is a noble gas. Sometimes the super octet, there is expanded octet also allowed. And here, if we start with a single bond here and allow the electrons 2, 4, 6. So, this fluorine has an octet 2, 4, 6 and this fluorine also has an octet. Now, xenon, if you allot 2, 4. Now, we can count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So, 10 into 2, only 20 electrons are there. So, remaining 2 electrons to be allotted, the 2 electrons must be taken by xenon. And here, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Xenon is now surrounded with 5 electron pairs or 10 electrons. This is called expanded octet. So, xenon difluoride, the so xenon has an expanded octet on either side, the two fluorine atoms are there and this must be the Lewis structure of xenon, what is called xenon difluoride.